why it's Tuesday. Tis. This it's, is it's miserable day here. This is P over here. M over there. Patricia. Mariah. And together we, we are, are PM Artist Studio. The weather has moved in. I am also kind of got sicky again. My little baby brought something <coughs> home, again. home again. I'm home coughing again. again. Mm -hmm. I don't know if but it's, it's not like or what. So yeah, that's fun stuff. Yeah. He's been a little cranky. The baby's home because school has been canceled for two days, which we're already like <coughs> <coughs> really, really just <laughs> our whole like schedule of things gets totally <coughs> out of whack. But that's okay. So hello everyone. Please say hello in the chat if you haven't already. Um. Do give those thumbsy upsies and all that business. If you don't want to say hello in the chat, that's totally fine. Be sure to turn your chat to live chat so that way you don't miss anything. Because that would be a real bummer. Uh, and I'm going to be a, this way I can, you know, say hello to everyone. <laughs> yes, exactly, Susan. <laughs> exactly. I, I'm just m muddling around over here. She is. She, she's just she's moving piles and <laughs> trying to figure out her life right now. <laughs> We're going to let her. Not poker too much. <laughs> She's not feeling real funny. We've got Anne. Aren't curious? That's Miriam. We've got Heather, Brad, Carolina is here. Carrie, Charmaine, Cher. Hello, I believe you are well, are are new. Welcome. Christy, Colleen, Darcy, Dana, Deb C, Devin, Devin. We found the tag. I told you that in Dee Dee's. Um, I, I saw her over in Dee Dee's stream the other day, and I said, Hey, by the way, we found the tag. Diane's here, Dorothy, hello, Eva, Evie, Ginger, Griffin Shell, that's Rhonda, Jeanette, aka Jeanette, Jolly John's here, Julie, Kim, Lee, Lynn, Lisa, Mich Michelle, Michelle, we got our, our Michelle crew here, that's awesome, we got Nightbot, she's the one who drops in the links in the chat, so, you know, be aware of that if you're looking for links and things. Panka, Reverend Sonia's here. Ricky Nordmeyer. Oh yay, Ricky! How are you doing? Are you are you out of the hospital or just you know going through um, PT? What do they call PT? What is that? Physical, physical therapy. There we go. Yeah, my brain was. It's probably a little rehab. early for that. I imagine she's. Sandy's here, Sherry, Silver, Granny. That's Lynn, Grumpy Gnome. I don't know if he's with her. Star Traveler. Star Traveler. Linda. That's Linda. And then we've got uh, Stitching Art. That's Paula. Susan Dufresne. Texture Junkies. That's Sharon. Tina. Trish. Violet. All right. Is Fran here too? Violet's here. Or Fran. Fiona popped in here as well. We've got Eva. All right. I'm going to go topside. Okay. <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay. All right. I'm just showing this. I'm, I'm not going to talk about it today. I'm going to talk about composition on Thursday in depth. But I just thought it was so remarkable because I had all this stuff out here and I was, I've been moving tiles all morning long. Some were utilitarian reasons because I had to clear space to make packets for y'all. Then, I was just struck, you know, by the same colors, but such a different subject matter. So... Did you say that that was from Eva? Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Eva... <laughs> Eva Macy. Macy. Allowed me, gave me permission to use this digital uh, composed print. And I just, you know... Well, number one, I love it just because it's... It's bold, but yet subtle. It just has all the qualities, I think, that make something into really good artwork. But I want to talk more about that in depth later. So today, basically, what we're going to do... I'm going to lose that. Yeah, I think oh, on Thursday I, is our, our deep dive. Deep dive. Mm -hmm. And I found... I, I was trying to find um, this notebook that I'd written down, names of people who... I don't know, it either impressed me or, or they had commented, they made intelligent comments, something or other. And Ann Lauber, you were one of them. And one of the first things I saw that you 
did, and I can't tell you what group it was in. It's one of the groups that I no longer belong to. Um, she doesn't venture outside of Makers anymore. I really don't need to. Yeah. Um, but it was the brooch that you sent to Joan Marone, and I did have a little bit of... Um, <clears throat> she was a little sad. I was a little sad. I just love that brooch with the three women on it. And that was one of the first, and I even have it written down, and I, I, I'll talk more about that on on Thursday because I've got a whole bunch of other stuff over here. Yeah, Ricky says she's going to be a, a couple of weeks in, in, in the rehab. Mm -hmm. <coughs> well, I I'm hope you have a, ni a nice rehabber. Yeah. S some of them have, you know, taken their training from <coughs> Nazi prison camps, I think. <clears throat> I don't know that that's true, but I've always thought they were just a little bit sadistic to go into that line of work. Yeah. You know, making people do things that hurt. Okay. So basically, I told Mariah, I said, you know, I, I think we should oh, just... Joan says, well, she got a, an ATC from Ann. Maybe Ann kind of took the same look of the three ladies and put it on the ATC. Oh. Maybe that's what the deal is. Maybe. I don't know. I just saw it there and I was going, oh man, she's a lucky duck. I've admired that brooch for a long time. Years. Years, literally. <laughs> yeah. Literally years. But anyway, I, and then I kind of laughed about this because I, this is the full color she spectrum. She did a little art piece with three women on it. Yeah, mm -hmm. so okay. The feelings don't have to be so, you know. I was like, jeez. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> and then I would, didn't want to be, you know, like the grump. Oh, she just sent her a little art piece. Okay, it wasn't an ATC. Okay. Well, there's a lot of swapping and things going on. I tell you, everybody's stuff is awesome. And you guys are so giving, which is awesome. And it's just, it, it warms our hearts. It really does. I, I just, um, I'm constantly astounded by it. And people giving away their good stuff. I hesitate <laughs> to do that now. I, I do on occasion, and I did when we filled up the she'll bags. She'll usually, like, really let you know, too, if it's something that she really, really, really likes. She'll put a note with it. <laughs> she'll try and tell you what to do with it. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. I'll tell you what. <clears throat> but anyway, I really, I, I think when people talk about colors and color harmony and Oh, and they, they're, they're also um, pointing out how your outfit matches your, you're very rainbowy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I never thought about that. Well, you don't have to worry about this shirt getting anything on it because it already has a whole bunch of stuff on it. And I was going to put on my apron and I thought, you know, at this point in the game, most of these people, Sandy, and if you have... are a new person... Sometimes I do get real gussied up and look nice, and I put my apron on so that I don't mess my shirt up or anything. This is not but a this, shirt that matters. This is not. This is a very, very old shirt. Did y'all see that <coughs> article? I <coughs> posted it in um, Makers about recycling clothing and what you can do to clothing, and people overwash their clothes, wears them out. I just had a discussion with my husband. I swear to God, he washes his sheets all the time. And he's the cleanest person in this house. He bathes more often than anyone else. He is the cleanest person in this house. And I'm like, you know, I don't know. Oh. Other than, you know, having an accident in bed, and I don't think he does that. Okay, so, Sandy, we do have, we have women. We have the, now, it's not a stencil. They're masks of the three women. We also have three boys, the J Crew. Yeah, I didn't receive those. She's still real peeved about the fact that the three... I didn't even know we had them, and all of a sudden I see somebody that got them in their bag, and I'm like, I didn't get any of those. <laughs> yes, you yes. I want to talk about that, too. Okay. Um, let's see. Um, announcements are going to be start, start to... <coughs> words. Okay. Announcements for like the month of February are gonna start rolling out probably tomorrow. We went ahead and posted the little bio, meet the designer about Carrie Griffiths 
I posted it because Anne was like, oh, she's just kind of, poor thing. She washed up 20 stencils and her hands are giving her a fit. Oh. Yeah, she did too much. I, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. So I went ahead and posted that because she's like, I don't know how to do the cut and paste. And I was like, I got it. Don't you worry. Got it. So I posted that. It links over to, um, to, to our website because we're going to start posting them there. So and they're always featured. You need to get some of this lotion and put it on before you start. Because remember when my fingers were sore? That was because I had been, you know, pushing paper well, around. No, I think thing. hers are more like an internal, like a... Oh, like arthritis type kinda, thing. Yeah. 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 That happens to me. I only pull one of these at a time because it really does Oh, full do body silhouettes. All right. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll put that out there for the designers. Hello, Denise. Welcome. All right. Now what are we doing? Okay, well, I just wanted to talk about this real quick because this is Tweaker, mm -hmm. Tweaker Tuesday. Tuesday. Yes. I gotta find some. Hello, Renee. I'm keeping that little card right up there because it's my inspiration card. Okay, remember I was using this as my color pal, my color mixing palette, <coughs> and so then I put Carrie's. Um, Okay, Mariah, you have to tell me again what is the name of this? Uh, whimsical Whatnot. Whimsical Whatnot. And can you can see, I, I added a little tape there and covered up three holes, two holes. I don't know, can't tell. And then I made some holes here and some holes here because I thought it needed it. And, you know, it probably... You can alter yours any which way you would like. Yeah. What, you know, it's kind of like mm -hmm. all this other stuff. If you get it, it's yours to do with as you please. Um, so anyway, <coughs> I went ahead and I put this purple hey, on there, put the tissue paper on there, left it for a while, and I thought, yeah, I wonder what would happen if I tried to pull this up right now, because it wasn't dry. Oh, thank you, Kristen. So this is what happened, and isn't it interesting? So we've got another layer we can add on to there. I just haven't decided what to do yet. But I'm really, I, I like this stencil a lot. Did you tell them that that was the thing that was left over from the other day? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That was my mixing palette. I just smushed it around. Yeah, and then put some other stuff on it. And then and put then... some other stuff on top of it. And I'm going to put some more stuff on top of it. But just not right it's now. It's going to be interesting to see if you can get that whole thing to pull. Oh, I will. You just have to let it dry. That's the trick. Mm -hmm. You have to let it dry. Okay, well, I've got this really interesting piece of tissue paper. I'm going to print some more on that. I've got this, hey, and this is, this is what happened when I cleaned off the stencil. It looks fab. I love the orange and purple. Isn't that great? And that's some of our colors that we've got in our, our, our color thing here. Well, I don't know why I keep referring to this as about any color you want. It's the rainbow. It, it, yeah. But we're also going to do black and white prints. And we haven't really decided. And, and then we, we had a little, she had a little meltdown on me and about size and figure, that, that's really my job. But I also try to meet her expectations, which sometimes she says some things to me. And then the questions I ask, she feels like, you know, I'm giving her a hard time, but really all I'm doing is trying to figure out what's going on in her brain so I can hopefully get there. And she says, well, I want it the size of an 11 by 14. And I'm like, okay, well, then are we going to half those? Or, like, are we talking, like, jumbo pockets? Like, you know, what in this space and time? And then I told her she was asking me questions that I really didn't have the answer for right at this moment yeah. in time. And that just happens. That will come... Mm -hmm. later and on I said, and I said ideally because <clears throat> this particular one is based on our little you know stuffed pocket things that are available on our website if you want to you know go over there and check that out but you can download it and it has like the little you know pocket thing because it's pretty cool because you <coughs> it's all on an 11 eight and a half by 11 sheet you fold up the little pocket things and so it's pretty cool with the layout but if she's talking about possibly making it bigger then I have to kind of rethink that layout. It can still be done. It's just not probably the most 
you, you're not going to be able to like get two pockets out of one sheet. You're really probably only going to get one and maybe something to make a tag or something like that. Anyway. I just don't think that's anything I want to talk about right now. <laughs> Anyhow. Okay, so <coughs> then I pulled the roses with the purple. And I think I'm going to put something else on top of that. And something up top of that. And then I'm going to put something on top of this. And this and this and this and this. Oh, this is the... I'll probably go ahead and put this with... Remember, this was the cheesy peach paint. Yes. See, I told you, it, it, it worked good. The places where it, it didn't is the places that it wrinkled. See those wrinkles? Mm -hmm. But those wrinkles came out on something else and, and they look really spectacular. But I think that this is quite nice. Okay, I'm going to put that aside. I don't know what I did with the rest of my... Oh, there they are right up there. Okay. I've got all those together. But these are all... And here's my... Adjusted Franken stencil piece. I might use that. That might be interesting. Oh, thank you guys for answering, Carolina. <laughs> See, that might be good. Hello, Tamarie. What do you think? I love that. Do that. All right, let's That's do that. Cool. And here's my leftover piece. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but, you know, it's just going to hang out somewhere. And I think you should do it in black, or you could do red. Or Prussian blue would be pretty. I was thinking about turquoise. Oh, yes. Because that goes in with our yes. color scheme. And look at this. Isn't this one wonderful? That is a yellow that I got off of my cart here. That's in a tube. And this is the one I pulled with the, um, with Fran's little lozenges. <laughs> Saucers is what that's called. Saucers. Yeah. And I've got this, and this neat. I need to put some more stuff on this. Oh, and here, and remember this dude? This is the, um... The one that got smushed out, but I don't think it looks bad at all. I think it turned out fab. I, it isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. I, I was just really irked at myself doing that. Yeah. Remember, she, she she rolled on the pull color a little too soon, so the black was still a little mm -hmm. gushy on that one end. And I don't know what to do. I don't know if I want to leave this as is. And when I have a question like that, it's probably just best to leave. Because I do think it's going to be... Thank you, Denise. I'm glad you enjoyed it. It's in that butterscotch. Oh, I just have things falling all over the place. And I don't know what to do with this so that I don't lose it again. Here. Oh, good. I'll give it to you and then you can lose it and then I'll be mad at you, not me. Sounds good. But look at that. See? <laughs> That's just wonderful. Oh, and of course I like that too. Mm-hmm. I think I'm going to leave this one alone for now. Okay. So I'll put that in that pile. Okay. So the stencil that I, I other than that one that I'm going to use there, I think I want to use is this guy. Because this is kind of the same, you know. Can <laughs> you just put that over there? Huh? In my pocket yeah. so I'll know where it is and I can keep grabbing it out. I'm referencing. I like it. Okay. All right, well, let's just get on with it. And, mm -hmm. You know, if we mess it up, we'll just do something else. There you go. And I did get oh, you guys are sweet. My plate cleaned off fairly well. I mean, it's still got some oopy goopy. Yeah, stuff. it's got kind of a purplish well, window there in the middle. It does. It's from doing the packets this morning. Mm. All right, well, let's just start with this. This is a pull-off when I was doing the packets this morning. I used the stencil extensively. <laughs> stencil extensively. Extensively. So, we want that to show. So, we're going to put this dude down. Or should I use the... Hmm. It's light. All right, I'm, ch I'm changing my mind. Changing my mind. I'm going to use... this because I think it's going to look 
marvelous on this. Might be kind of busy, but I don't mm -hmm. know. Hello, Jillian. Welcome. And Camry, I just put a link there. Um, that, that one's called Arch Deco, and then there's an Arch Deco style too, <coughs> which is pretty cool to, you know, <coughs> kind of have them both interplay. And it has the thick, the, art, the style too has the thicker arch in it. Oh, this one's Bloopy Loops. Yeah, Bloopy Loop. Puppy Dog. Puppy Tons. Dog Tongues is she calls it. I never aka that one though, so. Oh. Floopy loops. Alright, we're gonna go with this red, which is crimson. Alright, Windsor Newton. And we ordered this simply because it was on sale. Oh, that's wonderful, Jillian. She's on vacation or holiday, so she's able to watch. Oh, Normally yay. she watches on replay. Where's she holidaying? Where, where are you holidaying from? Maybe it was a staycation. Oh. I don't know. Well, sometimes you can vacation at home, and it's kind of nice. That's what they call a staycation. Okay. Or if you, like, stay within the town. Sorry. Uh, this this stencil, do you see what it's doing there? Kind of... It's stretchy. Irk, irks me, because if you don't get it down... Uh -huh. Flat, it does that. It will get stretchy on you. Mm -hmm. Because it's got room to do so. Okay, hopefully that's going to work. Don't be afraid to get a little extra paint out there. Oh, Michelle, don't, you know, don't, don't, don't feel like you're behind. We're, we're always kind of, you know, re, revisiting things. We sort of started a project, but I, we're at the very beginning of it, so I, I'm still very unsure. Oh, and we're, and this is where you really, you know, you don't just need to, and I, I Mariah and I work very differently. She's a planner. I'm a, hey, let's I got just get pile some, of stuff. <laughs> uh, let's get some piles of stuff. And I see worked what, at my piles for a Let's bit. see what we can do with our piles. And I didn't put enough paint on there. And then I'm going to go look at my other piles. And then I'm going to, uh, yeah, and then I'm going to look at my other piles, and then I'm going to come back, and I'm, this is a little bit different color red, but we don't care. I want to see if this pile can be married up with this pile. See if these things can be friends. Why am I keeping this thing? Okay, what? we can cut this up and put it into a packet. <laughs> <laughs> this really is the conversation mm -hmm. I sort of have, well, I either have it with Mariah or mm -hmm. myself. Mm -hmm. I do a lot of self-dialogue. And you have to roll all different ways because these little puppy dog tongues just go in all those different ways, you know? They're just wagging this way and wagging that oh, way. Oh, wonderful, and... Heather. Wonderful. No worries. <coughs> <coughs> okay, and we're going to... I'm just going to go ahead and go for it. This was the pink paper, remember? We're just gonna try to get some of that excess off of there. Not really worried about. Keep throwing my tissue paper away because I think it's trash. <coughs> <clears throat> I do that because you do get some residue through there and it gets all over your hands. And Quite irritating. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Now that is some nice She'll stuff. She'll show you in just a second. I, I will show you in just a second, but I've got to get yeah, this that dealt one. with. Whoop. Sorry. That's okay. Did it bonk it? Uh, you, you might bring it back towards you just ever so slightly once you get an opportunity. Just a little. There you go. I think that was good. Okay, if I don't get it matched up exactly, I don't really care. Mm -hmm. Man, that thing just keeps on a giving. Well, it's kind of dry, but we still got. I was gonna say, that's a lot there. Woo! Woo! Woo-hoo! All right, 
the Let's sunglasses. get another one of these jobbers that we're not too crazy about over here. I mean, it's not that I'm not crazy about it. It's just that I think the color's kind of mm -hmm. dull, and I just think I need to Hi, punch, punch it up a bit. Ooh, you know, like one. this one. Lovely. I think it would benefit. I'm just going to try to pull this, and it's still... Okay, you know, it's at that stage where it's not really dry, but it's not really going to pull anything up, which is really irritating. <laughs> we'll just let that get good and dry so I don't have to sit here and say bad words. We'll bust this dude out. Okay, let's get some transparent yellow iron oxide. No, we're not going to do that. Hmm. Benzimidazolone. Something like that. Really? It's one of those B words. <laughs> it's one of them. Woof. That is yellow. And this is cool yellow. I'll tell you what I really have noticed is, ooh, I love it. Started, you know, smelling again because my sinuses aren't all stopped up. <laughs> yeah. Ah! It is just, <laughs> I, some of this paint, and I've noticed that fluorescent stuff yeah, has it funny? The yellow and that that one, that the upper pink. Okay, yeah. wow. Now see, that jazzed that oh, up. Oh, and it also left a um, transfer. Oh, it did. Well, we'll just suck that baby right up. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that burns the eyeballs. That's exactly right, Joni. That's a PSA for today. Don't eat yellow snow. Now what are we doing? Um, well, we're just continuing on with our rat killing here. Mm. Um, you got a little this bubble is on your loopy prob loop at the bottom. It's probably, of, which one? Right there, where your hand, right there. Down, boy. Okay. Um, <coughs> yeah. Now this is kind of a radical move. Yeah. Didn't I get you some more of that? Yeah. Okay. We're just trying to yeah. use up what we've got. I was just getting worried. I couldn't remember and then I was like, I oh, think geez. it's in your I think I put it in your drawer, your bottom drawer. Okay. Yeah. Hello, Sandra. Oh. What I like about doing this like this where you're just, you know, really it's it's you're 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 not thoughting at all. You're just reacting to your paint and going on to the next layer and you're just not really worried about what it's doing, whether it's doing what you just wanted it to do or I'm gonna grab this one. This is something I did this morning with Izzy's little oh and I pulled the cutest little card and I, I kept it where it's got her her this little guy right here that's looking back at you with his bum where are those from these are from Izzy's drawings oh are those the little animals I know but are, is that a laser transfer I don't know I don't think so I think it's a stencil I've got a stencil how do you have a stencil well see that's nice it's a good one. All right, not quite enough of that came off. I don't really have anything. Ooh, on that. Joni's gonna be making a book for tags. All right, awesome. Okay, that took me a minute to figure that out through the chat, but yes, if, you, if you're 
if your urine looks like that, you, you should drink more water. That's true. Okay, that's going to be wonderful. We'll fill that with some really fabuloso color. I don't know what. My hands are so grody, I don't even know if it's... Okay, we used yellow a while ago. We're going to keep this one right here because we're going to do that. I don't think I want to do that. What else do I have here? got some little ones that I need to do on lower flights. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, here it is. This one might be nice. That's there you go. Okay. So basically, what I need here is I need a color that's going to pull this without giving me a lot of color. You know, you could use matte medium. I'm not using matte medium. I think that's, I think that's a very... Oh, yeah. Let me, um, one second. I'll find it, Joni. Um, I have it, like, in the printables, but I also have a version of it in the black and white papers. So, one second, let me find... What are you talking about? Um, this template to these... Well, it's not really a template. It's actually printable papers that are like this. <coughs> Look at that good bubble there. Boom! Oh. If you brayer this out enough, it gets pretty transparent. That's what I'm hoping for here. I really like this purple. Come on, shush up there. There we go. I think it's in this set. Fairly sure. Maybe I didn't make it part of that set. See, it's been a little while. It's actually been about two years, I think. <laughs> two years since what? Doing the stuffed pocket thing. Can you believe that? Really? I think so. It's definitely been over a year. Because this was... Okay, actually, we did this last... Not, not this November, but the last November. Wow. For the Maker's Creative Collab. Okay, I'm just testing this out. No, it's not going to pull. It's going to have to be. A, and I promise you we're going to do dry, dry pulls. But I think I've got enough empty place that we can just keep. But here's, um, like here, let me just put this link in there. And I can make a set of just the black and white ones. <gasps> this has got gold on it. Oh, great. If need be. I think that's like the turquoise one. I have a different ones. Yeah. Try to get this, you know, to go as sheer as possible. And to that extent, I'm going to put a little bit of old dragonfly in here. Because I want. I want you to see the um, pattern of the puppy dog tongues, but I don't want it to be. Ooh. Got some zingy green. Probably should have mixed that up a little better.
Okay, that you can see that's really saturated. Probably used a little bit much, but that's all right. <clears throat> Look at that. That's going to be so cool. Check this dude. Well, we're getting some of it up, and it may this may be very interesting. Mm. <laughs> Look, and it, it kind of transferred the wrinkle, I think. Well, it's, it's interesting. funny what's this, it's, what's coming up and what's whoa, that is trippy. Hello, Mary. Okay, well, I, I that is that is a roaring success. I love that. And I'm liking this one. I don't think I want to do anything else to that. This one's still kind of lame, but I don't think... See, I'm not feeling that. How about this? Oh, Rhonda got her first brayer skin today. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, you know, I gave someone a little explanation. Yeah, because they because Sharon had posted hers, and then there were some people that were talking about their frustrations. I thought that was real sweet that you just said, you know, patience and... Yeah, did you think did you think my explanation made it was, sense? I mean it was down near, you know, like what I would write. Well, there you go. Whoa ho. <laughs> okay, I don't want to use that. And I don't oh, always what was the, this what doesn't was, always work as a what was the green that you had put down on that previous one? The green? Mm hmm That you had rolled out. Oh, that was turquoise. No, you did the limey green. Oh, that was this stuff. The Pabeo. Yeah. Pabeo. Pabeo. And remember this and, and the orange makes a really nice kind of bronzy color. Which that might be. Oh, she, Rhonda said it helped. That, that, that helped her, that information that you gave. Oh, it did. Well, I can. It's it's a whole lot easier to show you, and I have some specialized tools that I yeah, use. That, that, here, here, I want. To sh I'll show you those real quick. Hey, Froil! Everybody, just hang in there. Hello, Froil! I hear. Am no, I, hey, whoa. I'm not. No, can't say anything. See, this is why they never tell me anything. Where's my little tool? What tool? Which one are you looking for? My nail. Um, Oh, that, I don't know what you did with that one. I think I put it back in my drawer. I've got two of them. Mm -hmm. And I know which one's the one that I use all the time because it's all geared up with, with paint. Yeah. Okay, this is a fabulous little tool. Can you see? It's kind of a little bit rounded. So what I do is I get it so, and I can't because this is just absolutely gooed up. You want to make sure you've got a nice thick. Let's look at this little dude. You want to make sure you've got a nice thick layer on there that you can pull I don't back. Think that's thick enough yet. Yeah, it's not. But then what you do is you kind of just gently go around and push that up until you can start seeing where it's going to separate. I don't know. This might. Oh, uh, moving is the worst. It, it's not. But then you just, I just gently go down the whole thing from one side of the brayer to the other. And then tear it. Yeah. So that then you can just gently. And that's like it. a cuticle, like you know, to, cause yeah. it's 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 nice and soft, but, or it's not really soft, but it, it it's it's rounded, so it's not going to puncture anything. Yeah, it's it is it, nice and blunt. There. Now this this end of this little jobber, this is what I use. This is to clear out that paint that gets in there and clogs up your brayer. So really, I I. I clean that out at least a couple of times, but when that gets really built up there, yeah. it kind of gives me an indication that what well, you were doing that like here. Oh, sorry. Uh, it drives me crazy when people do that on camera. I'm just like, come on, folks. Okay, can you see down in there how that gets clogged up right there and right here? And see that? It's already started. You just scoot it to the other side. You take your little implement in there. She enjoys this sort of thing. I do. I love it. <laughs> and then you just get that stuff out of there. And then that you, little you can continue do. on building up your skin. Yeah. You've got to build it up till you've got enough. It is. It's a cuticle pusher. Uh-huh. Cuticle pusher. Yeah. 
All right, we're going to use some of this. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some. Because sometimes I think this is not sticky enough. Does that make sense? It's not. Well, I think it dries fairly quickly, so it doesn't stay tacky what, for very long. Well, and it just, you know, it doesn't always let me do what I want to do. Now, this is fairly transparent, and I'm hoping it's going to go kind of orangey-pinky on me. But it's very sticky. Yes, it's the same tool. It has two ends. Mm -hmm. A multi-purpose tool. You can do your nails, too. Yeah. Oh yeah, the, the iridescent medium is, is the bomb to get. No, or wait, that's that was the golden. That was the golden. Golden. The interference gold fine. Yes, and I need to get this down on here and not yeah, it dries chit chat. Quick. Yeah. <laughs> was it a question from you, Fran? <laughs> Love it. Does that to me? Uh, okay, look at that. I got the. Is that the same tool? <coughs> <coughs> okay, I need to let that sit up a while. I like that color, kind of pinky, wonderful color. Let's see if we can do something with a turquoise here. Uh -huh. All right. Now, what was I going to put that on top of? <laughs> oh, no. That one looks good. Are you going to interference that one? That's a lot. I, I don't like that. Uh, I, I think that it's makes me a little too much. annoyed. I think it's too much. That one annoys me. I think me. we're going to pull this with... Um, orange. No. Ooh, I like that. Well, I want to use my other orange. You want to use the Pabio, Pabio? Yeah, because it's Pabio. a little, it's, a, it's just ever so slightly brighter. And I love turquoise and orange. Oh, look at that. That's a lovely trinket right there. That is a good one. Look at those cute Thank little. Thank you, Jillian. We've got more coming out this Sunday. If I can, you know, I tell you, this baby being home from school is throwing, like I said, throwing a little wrench in our system. <laughs> Poor thing. Um, but yes, we, we will have more stencils coming out on Sunday and more stamps. So stay tuned. And Thursday thoughts should be, like I said, pretty deep. I mean, P's got a stack of things over there. She's like, I just can't get into this. And I said, well, that's good because it's not Thursday. <laughs> She's oh, okay. It's probably over -briary. Oh, Jillian. Okay. Cool. What? Jillian and her sister ordered stencils together. Oh, well, that's great. And you can share them. Mm-hmm. Well, hopefully. Oh, well, that was a nice one. Well, job. and that's the orange and the green. If you mix those two together, we learned this from Patty Polly Paris. You mix the, or the pabellos, um together, and it makes a beautiful bronze color. It does. I need to do that. I like that color. Mm -hmm. Nicely done. Look at that. That's now I'm going to whip my card out. Look at that. It's going to look <laughs> so good. <laughs> like a magician. Yeah. Yeah. I just wish that lamp would. Why have. Why did that end up there? I got tired of knocking my hat on it the other day, so I, I just moved it. Okay. Oh, the blowout spot's her fault. Uh, that orange is the, well, it's number 353. 353. Uh-huh. And it's some of the Dyna stuff. Pabeo Studio Acrylics High Viscosity orange but it's the dyna stuff so it's you know kind of an interference looking things you know iridescent look at that 
fabulous. I love those little red cracky things, but then you can still see a little bit of uh, bloopy loop or whatever. I think bloopy loop was the one that was on there. Yeah, it was. And the other one I think was the um, the, the new little things. What are you doing? I'm putting this back. Oh. Because they were asking which one that was. Oh. Yeah. And the green, if you want to know, is three fifty nine. Okay. Very I'm really liking that. All right, we need to think about what color we're going to use on this. Uh, for all, it depends. So she's doing kind of quick pulls right <clears throat> now, but usually, like if she's layering it up, some of these sit overnight. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they do. I'm just trying. I'm. I'm. I'm thinking that. Every time I do this, I get a little bit more of that red on, but then I just leave some of it on there, and I think it's kind of cool. Yeah. Look at that color. I'm going to whip out my little card here. Ooh, I love that. Look at that. Ooh, can Look you at hold those. it up into the technology and give us a little wiggle? Not really. You're not going to do it's, that? Well, it's wiggly. It's tissue paper. But look at that, see? Oh. You want a board? Oh, I have one here. <laughs> Tell you this is not being real, <laughs> real nice today. This has got some other mucky muck underneath I it. I don't be know all right. if it's good. There we go. Look at that. Like that down there. And see, it's even got some of that Almost, look at that, Fran, Fran, look at that. Fran, Fran. Tarnished. Tarnished look to it. Yeah, that's, so that's interesting. It kind of, um, those colors over the black have created a nice little bronzy situation. Yeah, kind of dirty, a little bit. Hey, Laura. A little bit of crazy hey, in there. Lots of nice layers. Now, I'm really thinking... I need to let this dry completely before I, you know, muck about with it. But mm -hmm. I'm even thinking about coming in again with, um... I just want you to leave it alone. It's looking good. It's looking <coughs> this jobber. And some green. Maybe. I don't know. I really like it. Well, I do too. I like it right now. I might not like it later. All right. Well, let's get. We've got to do something with this because yeah, this is sad. just sad little print that you know. It's like it's, it, it, it wants to be something, but it's just not yet. Flip it. So what are we gonna do? Flip it. Turn turn your paper okay. the other there or one yeah. Okay. Well, that's that, so trippy though. Okay. We <laughs> what color are we thinking? And are we thinking transparent? We might go orange. Nah. I, I don't think, think that's going to gonna give us enough. Yeah, I think you need to do something blue. All right. We haven't done any blue yet. And we've got blue on our card. Yeah. We got uh, all the, the other colors. one is dark, the dark purple. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, we're getting very funkadelic. <laughs> we're getting very funkadelic? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because... We want all these <coughs> wild and crazy colors. Oh, look, and we'll bring this thing back and we'll get some more smushy, hey, sh smushy, smushy going on here. How are you doing today? And, you know, I, I'm i probably just at, now, let me see. I need to make sure I'm going the opposite direction. Is that going to be? <laughs> oh, this is going to be. Okay. Shush it, Mariah. I don't know what you're thinking. All right, let's mm -hmm. go with something wild and crazy. How about, or I have said blue. What about this? I love it. Do it. <laughs> oh, it'll probably turn into brown poop. That's all right. There's some brown poop on that card, too. There it is. The little baby was trying to sneak through. Did you see that? What are we printing on? Um, mainly those pieces, the larger ones, are the Carnival Wet Strength Tissue. I don't know if you can get it there in New Zealand. 
It was kind of tricky to get it in the Netherlands. It comes from the UK, though. And you, ha you can get a great big, huge box of it and cut it up, and it lasts forever. And I know it seems like a lot. Oh, yeah, if you want to clean, like, get those clean pulls like you see sometimes in our um, in our little reels or you know shorts Th those all happen because she's left it like overnight yeah okay we're just trying to get up some of this so it's not quite so we, we want we want the lines to show Trying to be real nice to her today too because she's being a little mm. oh and see we've got another piece that's going to be absolutely <laughs> lovely made, made another one <laughs> this is how the rabbits happen <laughs> <clears throat> okay am i going the right way i hope so i hope so it's down Now, the reason you're seeing this is because this was an 8x10, and I'm I'm using the 9x12 at this point. Oh, yes, definitely, April. And hello, I'm happy you're here. This weather is nuts. I looked out this morning, I'm like, nothing's happening. Brad said, it's on its way. <laughs> and sure enough. And sure enough, it, it was. Showed up. <laughs> We're, we don't have snow here. We have pellets of ice. Yeah. <laughs> Tricky murdery situation there. <laughs> oh, I think it's just marvelous. Look at that. It's some crustiness with Hopeful, some blame. Yeah, and, and see, <laughs> a lot of that was because of that those little irregular pieces that we keep leaving on here. Uh-huh. Ooh, that was a good choice. Thank you, Mariah. For uh the paper does not well, okay. I mean, obviously, if you, you don't want to use like deli, although you have used deli paper, you've left you've left the deli paper on overnight. Mm -hmm. The West String tissue is awesome um but no if, if you've got a good paper it, it's not gonna it's not gonna tear usually when you have the tearing is when it's in between dry and wet and then that's when the tearing happens and it hasn't dried fully and the other thing you've seen me take my fingers and do this around the edge crack your edges. because a lot of times what happens is when you brayer on your color mm -hmm. it goes over the edge a little bit where's that yellow Print. Yeah, I don't know where it is. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. You can see the little furry stuff here. We love the furry bits. Well, that's from where the paint went <laughs> over the edge. This is a dry pull. You couldn't get this pulling it right after you put it down. Mm -hmm. Those clean. And I know like some that. someone asked me once. Well, how do you, how do you know? Well, you know after you pull something up and nothing happens. Well, dang, uh, that ain't the way to go on that. That ain't it. <laughs> that ain't it. I love this this blue. It's a good blue. It is it's... a good blue. And I think it's going to be a really good blue to use with my, um, maybe one of the little stronger blues, solid blues, which we need to wait until we get our, and I just did that one. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, we can live dangerously. Okay, do it. I do need another 9 by 12. <laughs> Where are you going to put it? Um, that your your racking it. system is at capacity. <laughs> it is. I'll have to put away some of my smaller ones. Which As is our house. <laughs> I love our... I know my son visited us the other day, and you know he never comes upstairs. I think it makes him... Uncomfortable. Yeah. Well, it's like his father. He never, I he never could take him to the Goodwill because it made him itch. Okay. Now, <clears throat> we probably could have left this and gotten all of that red off of there, but I kind of like it. So, if you want a little more distressing or grunge, those quicker pulls or you know not leaving it on is what you know, you're going to get. The longer you leave it, the more you get. <clears throat> and I, it, I mean, this just has such 
such character. And all right, look at that. Pharrell said, whoop, whoop, she learned something. <laughs> okay, now we're going back to the blue because we've got it off of there. Now, the other thing is you need to make sure, touch your paper, because wherever this is wet, it's going to re... Oh, see, look. It's going to redeposit. Redeposit? Redeposit color up to your plate. That's probably kind of what happened on this, the, the thing we've got going over here. Uh-huh. <clears throat> we're just going to let both of those dry for a little bit. We're just going to grab something here. Look at this. Ooh, isn't that pretty? No, those are cracks left over. All right. Well, we need to really utilize this. I think we're just going to... We're just going to... Lisa says it looks like you could have found some hidden images in and that. And the thing I think about these, I noticed that today when I was making paper paper for the um, little packets, and I did some stamping, I just think that this would be really beautiful, you know, with, like, Fran's um, urchin, sea urchin stamp. Mm -hmm. And when I do, I, I figured out how to make it almost lavender by using black and red and mixing it up uh, a little bit. So the blue was from the U.S. Art Supply, that, that, um, yeah, the, the it's, colorful It's really, set. it's like totally fabulous stuff. But it's uh, the blue to gold. But you yeah. have to buy the whole set. Like, you know, and sell them individually. That's what's yeah. kind of a bummer. But it is from that U.S. Art Supply that we were always talking about with the interference or iridescence or whatever they call theirs. <coughs> Yeah, if there you need, is to that. need to put the link in the chat, I will again, but let me know. Okay, let's use something. Hello, Janine. Haven't used. Oh, I love this, but I don't know. <coughs> See, I'm afraid that that's just not going to show that off to its no. best. That green goes really dark. It really does. Now, here, Kitty. this might be fun. I know. The cats. Yeah, the cats. Yeah, I'm gonna bitching get about something. He probably wants in the room too. <laughs> it's like everybody else. He probably in went outside. Right and he went. What? What is this? What is this? I didn't order this. This wasn't here yesterday <laughs> or this morning. <laughs> he really is a good kitty for the most part. The only thing that really drives me crazy about that cat. Oh, and we're getting a little blue on that. That's all right. Yeah, he wanted in there. He's feeling left out. And see, Mazzy doesn't like to be in there when Izzy's in there because he thinks she's going to... All right, now can you see what's happening on my roller here? You don't want to leave that. And because if you do, it will have messed up your brayer big time. And it's going to leave that on all of your future... Uh, yeah, it is Murphy's oil soap. Yeah. All right, now we're just going to put something down and we're going to leave this because we're going to use this to stamp on and have those lovely little, those lovely little marks there. Mm -hmm. Subtle but really wonderful. All right, now let's do some things with these things here. <coughs> yeah, the Murphy's is for cleaning. The mineral oil is for conditioning. <coughs> yes. That is very true. All right, we want we're just we're just going to leave this Oh, that ought to be dry. Okay. All right, I, I, I haven't forgot about these little cards and we will address those because <laughs> I think they're really darling and I I, I want to use them. But we need to get our big tissue paper going here. <laughs> uh, how many plates do you have these days? I know it's over 10. I don't know. I don't, I don't count them. She, remember, we've cut up um, two 12 by 12s. And now she's requesting another 9 by All 12. All right, now this, this is a virgin stencil. Pretty much. I think they get a little glop on the... Yeah, I don't know what that. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it was. I, I don't know where that came from. But you, the first couple times around, make sure that you put down the side that has the little 
grooves on it, then mm -hmm. you can really feel it, the difference. All right, so now if I get this lined up here, is this going to be opposite? Yes. All right, so I'm going to put that there right like that so I can pull it over really quick. I love your flight of action there. I'm very impressed. <laughs> All right, let's use some of this. This is a very weird brown color. This is the, the paints that um, Lisa sent us, and I think you mixed a little extra other stuff in that one, right? Because remember, this is the one that kind of started oozing Yeah. when I opened it, so I just... Some went in a jar. And then I, I, I mixed in some more stuff to make it a little, Hi, a little bit more. But that's what color it is. And I think it's going to be really quite spectacular. I don't know that you put enough paint down. Huh. Keep in mind when you're using these stencils that you will want to use a bit more paint than you normally would. Yes. Because you got to fill the grooves. Now I'm just equally distributing it. Distributing. Yes, Black it. Flash. Thank you, Lisa. <laughs> I, was, I was like, I'll grab it over here in a second. It's, it's kind of a weird brownie, bronzy, but not. I just, I, I, I a, mean, I really, I absolutely love it. It's very unique. Plus, she, like, this one's been altered. Yeah, ever so slightly. I can't tell you what's in there. <coughs> it has some of that iridescent medium in it. Yes, feel the grooves to get groovy, y'all. Very good, Devin. <coughs> I think this will look lovely, like with the orange. Or even red. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? All right. I, I, I'm not ignoring you, but I, I'm, I'm, we'll bring I'm it back here in a bit. having to move along here. Do you use the shiny side to pull of the paper? Kind of depends on really what you're looking for, but I haven't noticed a huge difference. If you are talking about like what are we talking about? The tissue paper. Oh, if I think I'm going to do any pencil work at all on it, I always put down the um, side that has a little bit of a texture to it, just simply because I think it gives you a better surface to work with and you don't have to come in with your texture paste. Ooh, very nice. <coughs> I don't know that I love the red out there. Oh, I kind of like it. But it's there. Okay, so this needs to set a spell. And like I said, I don't know how long that necessarily means. Um, <laughs> Michelle's going to bust out with her Woodstock memorabilia because we're getting so groovy. Boy, those cracks just keep on a giving. Well, we have new ones now. We pulled up some of the yeah. others, but we left behind some of the others. This is like, uh, leave a penny, take a penny. Look at that. Isn't that just magical? That's beautiful. Well, uh, no, no, yeah. No. Here, I'm going to whip my, my little card out and show you how wonderful that's going to go with the rest. Of yeah, that I like a lot. Bloopy Loops is one of the ones I should make some pattern paper with. Yes, it is, because I think that... Well, number one, it'd the be black and white. fantastic. I need to put it in a laser print. Oh, yes. Because, number one, it's easier to do than the actual stencil. And the re reason is, is because, see, you've got lines, so you have a lot of open space here. So when you come back in with another color, and I, what I love here is I, how the, it's kind of concentrated there and a little bit more over here, but over here it's very light. Mm -hmm. I, I really, it's, it's totally one of my favorite stencils. And I, Mariah always, always says bad things. It, it's a tricky one to cut. <laughs> Let's just say that. Uh, there were quite a few, you noticed you got quite a few perfectly imperfect. Those of you that won the giveaway, you probably ended up with some bloopy loop stuff. Yeah, had a lot of those. Mm -hmm. 
All right, let's, we don't want to bring this back, but we want to be thinking about what color we're going to use with it. And then maybe this time we go this way with this one. Well, Brad designed that one, the bloopy loops, but yes, we, we don't show anybody else's stencils. Well, we've shown Carrie's, because we like her. Carrie Gibbs. That's about it. You won't see any others. And she also makes her stuff in UFO. Okay. So, we're just going to leave this alone for a little bit, because our our big um, plate is being utilized for something <laughs> else. So, let's start with, okay, here, we've got this little dauber, which is, you know, I think that that color is, look, that color right there. <laughs> look at it. it. It's in there. It's in there. But I think we just need to jazz it up just it, ever so. It needs to be tapped back. It doesn't need to be the, the star of the show. It needs to be the guy in the background because, you know, it, this yes. is more like security. And I, I, I'm, <laughs> really, I'm really leaning towards lime green. <clears throat> A majority of things that we do are cut to order. Now, that being said, sometimes as we're cutting things, especially the smaller stencils, we can get multiple ones on a sheet. So we then have a little bit of inventory. But a majority of everything that we cut is like to your order. This has lot, lots of stuff on it. Now, I don't know what this is out here, but I don't want it. Looks like a That's right. I was wondering if anybody was going to mention it. I wasn't going to say anything. So, what? Sherry has mentioned, she says, this is our last day of 100 watching. <laughs> <laughs> so, we will do the free giveaway uh, for the stencil. <coughs> Basically, what that is, is it's $15.99 for the, to the shop. You must place an order of $30 or more to get that code to work. You may not stack it with any other promo codes, just because that's how our shop works. Um, let's see, is that, I think I've covered most of the questions now, because I do get those questions quite often. Um, but yes, we will do the giveaway here in a moment. This is a really grody plate. I should Whomever remember. wins needs to reach out to me, and then I will get you that code. I just don't feel like doing it right now, so we're just going to go with it. Uh, Lynn has... Dirty plate. She has requested some bo goose, goose poop green, please. You <gasps> yes. can do that. And as Ann says, most of the time, yes, we, we ship pretty quick. We, we usually have things out within that day or the next day. Now, if things get a little hairy, it'll go on into maybe a, a second day, but usually it's that day or the next day. This is kind of nice because it's kind of a yellow green. And it's going to brown out the red. Oh, thank you, Sandy. Ooh, it looks really good with that. <laughs> that purpley brown. <laughs> Don't want to lollygag too terribly long here because it is a fast dryer. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, we'll do that giveaway here in about 30 minutes. let some other folks get in and you know do all that do although those of you that have come in please do say hello in the chat we would love to say hello back if you want to just hang out in the background that is totally fine as well please give those thumbsy upsies they are very very important because it lets other people know hey i liked this you might like it too if you're new to the channel subscribe ring the bell do all that youtube -y business and you will get notified we do this three times a week are you finished? Sure. Notice we have a little transfer there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you do. That's pretty funny. Pretty funny. Okay, now where's some more of these <coughs> less than desirable prints that I've got here? <laughs> Julie's waiting to win that car. <laughs> we, we haven't gotten that big yet, Julie. <laughs> I don't know if you'd want that car that we would be able to provide. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, we haven't used any Prussian yet, and Prussian's going to, I just don't want to deal with that little bit of, you know, <laughs> whatever it is on there that's kind of ho-hum. Ho-hum. <laughs> oh, no, we've got tool malfunction. <clears throat> I, 
that, yeah, I was just thinking that that would be pretty funny if we, we could come up with some PMR to Studio little Hot Wheels for the giveaway. Hot Wheels? Yeah, to give away a car. Oh. She just got that. <laughs> she liked it. Yeah, I like it. All right, now. Yeah, you can have a car or a stencil. <laughs> I've got to have this little jobber handy. Yeah. Uh, did you, is that Prussian that you put down there? Mm hmm Okay. Did you tell everybody that? Um, I don't know. Which Prussian did you use? I used golden. Very nice. Is it the open? Um, oh crap, I don't know. Oh, that. no. No, okay. it is not. Thank goodness. Sure. Yeah. Be here all save, day waiting save, for that Save thing. your open for when you, you're going to lollygag around and, you know. Or if you're visiting smoke the Smoke and drink in between your <laughs> poles. You ain't got anything else to do. <laughs> oh, um, the go goose goose turd green is basically, um, I think she used the golden, right? Green. Yes. That's kind Fluid of acrylic. Yeah, that's the closest we think. you were at Ennis. So does that like, you know, over there by the head in the H-E-B? Because we're in Saxy. I love our, we got quite the Texas, Texas crew. Yes, a, a Hot Wheels with a personalized paint job by P. I think that'll be pretty cool. Maybe what I could do is find some that are, you know, all roughed up and kind of cheap on um, eBay and then we could paint them. Give them a little, you know, what do you call it? When you make over. Yeah. Restoration. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. <laughs> okay, we left a lot mm. behind. And that's mm. okay. We're going to let that dry. You list. That's what I was thinking of. That's the hub. <coughs> See, Brad knows. <coughs> yes. <laughs> Ooh, Deb saw some at the, at the Goodwill. Yeah, I, I like the Goodwill. I can't get anybody to go with me. Well, might have to go hunt down some Hot Wheels. Nobody will go with me. That's too dark. That's opaque. Well, if I put a little of that out there with some of that other stuff there, might be just what the doctor ordered. Okay, I'm going very, look at that, this nice clean. Deb C said she would go with you. I, I'll tell you what, Mariah, she's a poopy diaper head. I am. I don't enjoy well, it. That's, it stresses me out. And I, you know, she says, well, what do you want? God, it just sounds just exactly like her father. Yeah, I, like I, I said, I won't know what I want till I see She just it. wants to look around. I, and I, don't I just want to look around. I have time for that. And God knows you don't go places like that with Brad. No, Brad's on a mission. He's on even more of a mission than I am. Oh, yeah. He's. I'm willing to peruse for a little bit. He is not a peruser. Mm -mm. He's like a tiger in a cage. He'll, he paces right next to you. You does? We, we, we going now? We good? You get what you need? <laughs> Did you find it? What are you, you looking for? <laughs> I can help you with that. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Okay, I think that that's still a little bit too strong. Well, I like that. I know, but I think it's not going to... I think it's going to be too... Too much. Too opaque. I don't know. But you know, if that happens, you just add some of this and you can, but do mix it up because if you leave it on there in just one spot, what it's going to do is it's just going to be in that one spot and it'll leave mm. a naked spot. Susan's a peruser. She'll go with you. Good. Okay. Let's deal with that later. 
Now who's driving? Because she don't drive. <laughs> I mean, she can. You just don't really necessarily. She, she gets a little stressy. Well, and especially if I don't know where I'm going. Yeah. Well, and the Goodwill around here is actually a pretty good one. But getting into it is the most ridiculous thing. Because it's on this weird, oh. like. And you only have one chance. <laughs> It's like the Big Ben thing. Because then you have to go... All the way around. You have to go to Houston. <laughs> if you want to go to the cool one, you know, downtown. Yeah. We've got well, That's actually ones. the Salvation Army. Yeah. It's the one I really, really like. <laughs> Susan says that her, uh, her studio shows signs of deep perusing. Yeah, Brad, Brad has a rule that five things need to go before something else comes in. <laughs> woo, 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 that's very Now, nice. see, we, we, we saved it from being this really poopy, poopy, brownie, greeny, whatever. I'm going to see if I can get some of this up. Probably not a lot, but we don't really care because this is the one that we've just got little bits and pieces of things on anyway. Bye, for all. Thanks for hiding. Oh, yeah. See? Picked up some. <clears throat> the thing about it is, is it's probably not going to pick up anything at this point where the paint is. It needs the paper. Oh, my gosh. I just absolutely love this. Now, check this out. Yes, it's the golden green gold. That is that is the goose, goose poop or goose turd brown. Or, sorry, green. Okay, I'm done with that one. That one's the golden green. Freaking lot early. Okay. Will you show that in the in the, in the rural technology for you? Yeah, that's the stuff. And I also have it in heavy body. And I ever oh. since I got it, I, I, I don't we have one of use it very often. All right, I've got a little bit, and what I've noticed about this paint, <clears throat> and it's a quality that can be endearing, but it can also be kind of maddening if you don't remember. It's going to resolubilize the paint that's already out there. Uh, well, she mixed that blue, teal, yeah. green, turquoise business that went on there. But what, what did you basically use to mix it? If you could show those again, please. Sure. Before turn, you start. Turn this yeah. upside down and let it think about itself. Okay, so what did I use? I used... <coughs> some of this remember I put a little bit of this down then I mixed in a little bit of the blue stuff so that's the golden phalo turquoise right golden turquoise phalo phalo. turquoise yeah then I mixed a little bit of this stuff and it was still too strong so then I came in with my dragon fly glaze yes and so then the um, folk art stuff is that metallic uh, the the blue ice and if you don't have that, oh, you need to get some of that because it's fantastic to mix it is, with things. I, I use it on all different mm -hmm. kinds of things. Now what I'm going don't to do. Don't get it on Amazon. It's very expensive for some reason. Is I'm going to hopefully get some of this stuff to come up along with my turquoise, you know, uh, color shifting chain, color change aqua green. This is a really good color too. The problem with these little jobbers is I think you have to buy the... Oh, look at that brayer. Oh. I'm seeing you, Fran. Fran said that she would go to the thrift store with you as well. I, I just... You know, I used to have a really good friend. She lived in Clovis. And, oh my goodness, we would just go and we would just laugh. Oh my gosh. And it was just so much fun. Fry is not fun. Mm -mm. She, she does not see the humor nor the um uh Devin you might look um anything that's like a Walmart or you know that type of store I think that's where a lot of people get theirs the okay folk art that's a really beautiful one what else do we have here that we can whip down on this paper here where we've got this kind of yellow. I mean, this is really nice, but and 
and it's transparent so the yellow is going to show through it may not be yellow anymore it may be more green but look at that yeah, but it's not a in your face you know green yeah. thank goodness Pretty? give us a wiggle on that one because oh. there's going to be some see see a little more on it when you do that it's subtle yeah now there's still a little bit of that out there okay let me check my hmm. arm see if i've managed to I wonder if they would special order it for you. Do what? Michaels, if they would special order it. Since they carry the Folk Art brand, if she could request that particular, that ice blue. Oh. Well, somebody ordered it, and they sent me a whole bunch of them. Mm-hmm. So they are available singly. Yes. <coughs> Hard on me. I just, I don't know, this, I'm looking through my pile to see if there's anything over here that I might need to really like in everything that I've got. Just kind of down to the, yeah. that, that, he, he, there are no truer words than my husband just put in the chat there. What is it? He says, I don't follow rules except for the ones that he makes up as he goes along. That, that is very true. I'm just leaving that for now because I don't know what to do with it. And I love that purple. Well, they were very expensive on Amazon, but if you really want it, they do have it. And I'm happy with this. I'm not doing anything to this. I love this. Get some rest out of there, yes. In our color palette. <laughs> now, this is just, you know, I don't know. It, You know, it does have that little bit of gold. and That's quite sweet, but I, but I think we really need to pump it up. Can I spray it? Pump it. Can up. I spray it? Pump it up. Yellow. Do it. You're going to obliterate your... No, it's, it's transparent. It, you just... I could go with lime green. Let's do lime green. I think that's a better choice. But you're still going to... Lime gonna... green. She's going to obliterate the, the little cool pattern in the sauce. I don't think so. I mean, it may subtilize it. it subtilize it. So, oh, oh, that sugar trinket bit. just fell it down did. in the hole. It did. I saw it fall in the hole. <coughs> always give it a whack especially if you're putting them upside down okay we're not putting any more patterns or anything on this we're just trying to get some interesting color transparent color Ooh. boy that's looking good I'll have to remember to pull that baby off oh Lisa's favorite color shift color is lime green could leave that on there and then of course it would pull it all up. I don't think you want, yeah, for this you definitely don't want to do that because it, it would for sure get rid of. Now see, you can still see them a little bit. Mm -hmm. They're more of a raised <laughs> surface than anything. <laughs> They've now become texture. Yep. I'm going to whip this dude back down here. Get a little more stuff on it. <laughs> get in on that action. <laughs> Clean that plate off, hopefully. Oh, look at this. Yes. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm going to retire that. Yeah, that's good tag making business right there. Ooh, especially if you, um, see what's great about something like that is that you can come in and put either texture paste or stencil butter or something over it, and, yes. and then it really is like, you know, next yes. level. Next level. Yes. To be sure. All right, we're pulling this whether it's done or not. I'm just tired of waiting. I just need that plate. Gotta get my next one ready here. I guess I don't know why I'm fighting that. I'm not gonna use it. Yeah, Certainly not for that. Hello, Barbara. Boy, that red just, I think it's made it into just about everything that's gone on that plate. <laughs> in the last two days. <laughs> Isn't that oh, just cool looking? Though. You know, it's really cool. So, see, the red hit only on the areas where the black flash is. It's not really in with the blue. I mean, it is on there, but it isn't coming off that way. 
that's cool. All right, now what are we going to do with, with this? this? Hmm, where's my stencil? Because we want to use this. Yes, uh, we do. I do not know what you uh, want to mix up there. Hmm. You need transparent. I think I do because I really, you know, I'm really feeling this whole, how about this? I love it. Do it. Oh, Jamie, she almost forgot about the thumbsy upsies. If anyone else has almost forgotten about the thumbsy upsies, now's the time. Did we already do the giveaway? We have not. I got five minutes. Oh. You want me to do it right now? I can do it right now. Mm -hmm. I can get it queued up. Yeah, I want you to. Okay. Oh, and you know what? We've got, actually, we got to do two different giveaway things because we need to do the little wheel of spinning for the ATC for those of you that left a comment on the last video. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Let's do that real quick. Let me find my... There we go. I'm going to spin that. I really... I almost like the... Um, Lucy Goosey oh, Fluid. Arkansas Crazy Quilter. All right. You need to reach out to me. If you are in the stream right now, please do let me know. Or if you watch the replay or any of that, or if anybody knows who the who Arkansas Crazy Quilter is, let her know to reach out to me. And I will get her address for an ATC. That was the ATC. She's new to the channel, so I, I don't know who, who Arkansas Crazy Quilter is. Oh, that's going to be a nice one. Yes, it is. Down. <laughs> okay, let me see. Is this right? Opposite? Hopefully. Too late. <coughs> yes. What's our hashtag going to be today? Tweak. Are you looking? Are you looking? Ooh, and see, just again, those little bits of red in there are so cool. Oh, and it's EA. <coughs> <coughs> yes, good job, guys. Okay, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? I think I'm for you. There you go. Yeah. T W E A K, tweak. I don't know what the other tweak is. Okay, we're going to use some of this. Ooh, yes. This is rich express espresso in the deco art, dazzling metallics. All right, have we kind of slowed down? think so. I'm going to roll it. Everybody get in there. Joni! Aw! Well, there you go. Very nice. Joni, just remind me and I'll get you a code. Well, we're getting some more wrinkles for future. <laughs> for the next one. For the next one. <laughs> We've just about got all the red up. Did you notice that? Yeah. I mean, it. it... 
and really I the reason I do this with this tissue number one it actually pushes it down in there and makes it makes the cracks a lot less um, Bye, Jeanette. Thanks for hanging. visible and we're going to leave that on because there's no reason we Ooh, that's gonna be lovely now you're, you're leave that's gonna dry we're gonna let that dry good Everything and, will come up. and we'll be able to get I'm hoping everything yeah. off of there now there'll probably still be the cracks yeah but remember it's a, it's kind of that clear anyway so I mean it wasn't clear but it was very very transparent rich espresso mm -hmm. whatever that means kind of you know dirty dirty gold <laughs> dirty gold all right now my oh okay so um if you guys come back leave a comment um i will you, you have basically 24 hours all right yeah 24 hours from the end of the stream to come back leave a comment let me know that you want to be entered in for an APC, and then I'll do a little spinning wheel on the next screen. Because we like the spinning wheel. And I like to give them away, but doing the 27 was nuts. So we're going to kind of give them away one at a time. Yeah. Because <laughs> we feel that's better. Okay. Green gold. AKA. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you for dropping that in, Darcy. And yes, Darcy, I started watching, um, I started watching your color challenge. I love, you have some awesome sprays and stamp colors and stuff. I'm a little jealous about that. I need to get back over there and watch the rest of it. My baby interrupted me. I think she wanted to watch Peppa Pig or something. You know, riveting television. That sort. Sometimes you just gotta just yeah. go with it. We do, because she's... <laughs> uh, sprays are my favorite. What is that? Sprays are my favorite. Oh yes, Mariah's a sprayer. I'm a sprayer. She's a sprayer from way back. Check this out. Um, that is a very good question, Devin. Um, I. I can't remember exactly. It's it's inside of the five by seven, if I remember correctly, because it's not going to run from end to end on a five by seven plate for the eye. But I can't remember exactly like how much. I can tell you that later on, or if Brad wanted to measure it, if he's available, he might be able to tell you that. Yeah, you thinking? What are you thinking about? Hmm? What are you thinking about? I don't know. I'm just, you know, I'm just going to put something down here so I can get some color on these little stamped off pieces. Okay. Now, I think I would like to see you use a little bit of, especially on the bigger ones of the Galaxy, um, the Celestial Gateway. Because I think it kind of goes with the tag. I also think you need to bring in the stars. Just some, you know, food for thought. Duly noted. All right. Oh, um, that is a very good question as well. So if you want, um, if you want our system to say oh hey did you forget something like the little abandoned cart you basically have to make it all the way to the point of checkout except for putting in payment you gotta fill it out so that way it knows to email you oh goodness that that's just Bradley <laughs> what 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 <laughs> I tell you he makes things happen when you know one way or another Ooh. Okay, Susan has a random question. What is everyone's favorite resin? 
considering quality plus price not too expensive everybody's favorite what resin oh I didn't yeah we don't know about I that. don't know about that but a lot of these people will about that what are we gonna brad, see? brad wants me to i told him that he has to run chat because i don't want to stress you out <laughs> for what to do a stream on mondays monday morning a one hour one for what for <laughs> for me so i can do like you know little collagey things the spray thing you know the things oh. that i do okay I'm, I'm all for yeah, it. I knew you'd be all for as it. As long as I don't, I don't have to. I, I, I'm not up for that because I don't. I don't. I do a sucky job at it. She's all right. I can't type. So what do you guys think about that? Brad running the chat. Yes, Mariah doing spray things. Um, you know, making the tags, doing the little backs of the ATCs or even fronts of ATCs because. I like to do some fronts too. I'd love to make a book. We yeah. are making a book. There you go. <coughs> and what I think will probably happen with this whole bookmaking business is that I'm going to end up making one structure for P because she's going to have some ideas about what she wants to put in it. <laughs> and then you see this this was mine and then she helped this is what usually happens too she'll come along and so she helped with the little feather things which were fantastic and then she made the little front deal but I attached it all like she'll give me pieces and then I make the structure Yeah, Brad doesn't want to be on camera, so you would get his voice only. Or maybe a big smiley face. Okay. Carrie says he thinks Brad's doing a subtle uh, company takeover. Actually, he's been running the show from behind. I mean, pretty much since we, we started doing um, the March Madness. Because he made that happen. Because we were both like, <laughs> we don't know if we can do that. And then this is how he did it. He's like, if you can do this thing for two weeks, then just think everything after that will seem so much simpler. And it really did. Because like streaming every day for two weeks was nuts yeah the last couple of days i was just like man i'm so done with this i'm kind of burnt out it's, it's hard to just it was a lot well it was hard to you know be on you know and i'm i just i think you should be on if you're gonna be on indeed indeed did you get a transfer from that one when you i i don't know so that I, was a I really just, light color needed a something to put mm -hmm. down here to <laughs> Deb, Deb says Mr. Carey kisses the plate his pee slaps it <laughs> <coughs> I golly sometimes you just got to get those people to yeah I really love this blue yeah and I'm just using these simply because I I don't have to think about if they're transparent or not because I know that they are. And they're just so easy to use. 
when you don't want to, you know, cover up a large. <laughs> Deb said it was even exhausting to watch. <laughs> what? The March Madness. Oh. Yeah, Brad's like, are we doing that again? I'm like, no, oh, I don't no, know. No, 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 no. That, that was just to kind of see, like, what days made sense. We, we like, yeah, no, we are not doing March Madness again. Now, see, I think these are going to be really cute little, um... Oh, yeah. Just trying to reach the back here because, you know, it's like you always think that the good stuff is the back. Oh, and here's this color. I forget about this color. <gasps> what? Yeah, Brad, yeah, and that's not true. Brad's face is not radio face. He's being silly. Oh, goodness. So, Diane sell, said that she checked the Canadian Walmart for folk art blue. They have it. It's only thirty-two seventeen. Like, for how many? One? That's, that's crazy. Mm-hmm. So, Michelle, um, the jelly printing on fabric, we've done the videos. We, we can't do it in a live stream. It's just our process of doing it and the area yeah, I don't that have, is required to do it. My studio isn't set up for that. Yeah. But we, we did, we, I don't know if you saw the video of the bags. We did that and then the shirts. And I'm sure that we'll do it again at some point. But always will be a recorded video. She got to keep moving with it too. Like it's not something that like there's a lot of stop and talk about this kind of thing. It's get it down. Yeah, push you, it, you, you, know. you you do not have a lot of lollygagging time. Mm -hmm. Really, do not. Yeah, exactly. From one bottle, that's insane. It's what that was one one bottle. Wow. I mean, that's like premium. Nuts. We need to bootleg. No, I know. I'm thinking about... We need to send poor Devin some paint. <laughs> I'll take... Well, I don't know how much it would cost shipping. Yeah, so, Lisa Mingus is in her Walmart is a dollar forty seven. That that sounds reasonable. Oh, I love the wasp. That looks great, doesn't it? there making sure everything gets a little color on it uh yeah there might be some restrict yeah can you order it online at michael's and have it delivered to the store well that's a thought sometimes they do that Gosh, you could. I said bootleg. You make some money. <laughs> keep reaching for that. I need to put that away because that's one. Use this one all up. Yeah, and it was just um, about two weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago, when we did the the bags. And then the shirts was quite some time ago, but I linked um, from the the bag video at the end of it. Yeah, there's the end cards to the shirts. The shirts are a lot easier to do than the bags. Yeah. Because that canvas 
it's really hard. You really have to push to get it into yeah, the... Yeah, because the grain of it is, is so much more um, obvious. So it's hard to get details. Yeah. So if your yellow is a little bit too... Just put some of that... And see, look at the difference. This is the same yellow here. Oh. That's with the blue over it. Nice. Tone it back a little. Yeah. Add some depth there, too. <clears throat> yeah, definitely. Kind of gives you that um, kind of holographic, like when you move it, 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 it kind yeah. of pushes it in. And then there's one little spot there that I don't know what happened. <laughs> Who knows? All right. We got 15 minutes. Oh. Yeah. Well, let's look at what we've done today. That would be fantastic. All right. So we've done all these little jobbers. And these are just things that I just randomly stamped as I was I like either cleaning. The wasp. Show that again because it's like all iridescent. -y and when you put the iridescent, the color shift stuff over the black stamp. See? Look at that. Oh, cool. Kind of purpley. Mm -hmm. I love that wasp. And that's just, you know, this is just cleaning off the, the stamp. Cleaning off the stamp. Mm -hmm. Same here. This is um, a semic writing. Can you go into more detail about the benefits of glazing sometimes? Well, the whole idea of, of, of glazing <coughs> is to make subtle change, either subtle changes or to stabilize a color that you have underneath and a lot of times these chalky paints I love the opacity of them but they're very you can take your fingernail and you can flick up they're chalky they're chalky so I kind of like to do something now that of course they're not going to be opaque anymore they're going to be sort of shiny and whatever but I don't I don't mind this I don't think it's like glaringly no it's not metallic it just adds that little bit of lovely finish that you wouldn't otherwise. It's kind of like using bronzer on your skin. Yeah. You know, it just gives you that dewy glow. <laughs> dewy glow. There you go. <laughs> you want that dewy glow on your gel prints and such. Yeah. Or stamps. <laughs> yeah. And then this crazes like crazy. It's like crazy, crazy. Crazy, crazy. Look at that beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? I love it. <clears throat> Turquoise color there. All right. So we used this a lot. You remember? And then we used where's my other one. Covered it up. Oh well. Wow. Um, all this of is, she, th those last ones that she was doing that with were <clears throat> the shuttle arts. Mm -hmm. Or shuttle, yeah, shuttle art. Yeah, color change, whatever. Mm -hmm. And remember this one? This was a double one. They're the super cheapy, like come 16 or 20 to a set because <coughs> folk art has the color shift and shuttle arts is a color change but they're almost exactly the same thing yeah you get more colors with the whichever color change yeah whichever one you and look at that i just think that's absolutely gorgeous mm -hmm. and that is adding in the um Isn't that pretty? Layering, layering, layering. And if you layer, the reason I love the transparent stuff. Now, this yellow, if you're going to, if you start with an opaque paint <laughs> and then you just layer on the transparent paint, that's going to sort of kind of show through forever and ever. Mm -hmm. And then here's the other, I want to. Just the other, isn't that? Look at that! Isn't that trippy? The other stencil. You need both of them, and you also, and Mariah, she'll be real mad at me. She'll say, "I wish you wouldn't show that," because every time you do, I have to get get orders with that. Okay. Oh, lost something there. We've had that one. Didn't do anything to it. Remember, this is I the bronze that. with the turquoise over it was picking up some of the red blotchy that's so cool looking business that was 
on there. I mean, it looks like really fancy tile. I mean, that's cool. And then this is just the, um, I don't know. Oh, karma, that is not a dumb question at all. What do you do with all the prints on either like deli or tissue paper or any of that? So they're really wonderful to collage with. The deli paper is a little trickier. It's going to be a bit filmier looking. Um, one nice thing about the tissue paper is that it, it usually goes transparent. I didn't do anything to this one because I just, I, I don't feel the need to. I like it. If you end up with a really beautiful print, even on deli paper or tissue paper, you can glue it down to like a Jack Rich, a heavier stock paper. What you'll want to do is, now it's tricky and you, you got to get good at gluing. You got to know what you're doing. Be committed. Glue it down. If you get it nice and smooth, then keep it under, you know, you got to press it. Make because it it'll, it'll, it'll bunch up even if you don't, you know, if you just... If you have it all smoothed out, it will still kind of do a bunchy, wavy thing. You want to press it. But I've I've done a few of her prints. She's like, oh, I wish this was on a nicer piece of paper. And remember this one? Mm -hmm. Oh, that, that's so fantastic. This is where we started our red. That just <laughs> kept on giving. <laughs> and this just started off as kind of a weak pull off. But I love this over here. Yeah, that turquoise and bronze. Yeah, mine too, Tracy. That's pretty cool too, though. This has been some good ones. Good tweaking today. Now, I really honestly feel like that if I went over this with, say, a red iron oxide. You need, you got nine minutes, so why don't you do it? You oh. have an open plate? Oh, I think so, yeah. I pulled everything. I haven't gone through all of the ones that we did today, though. Oh, okay. Well, keep showing. Okay, I just have a few more. Here's this. I love that. This is really that zingy, pretty. zingy, yeah. And this one. And then remember, we had the red, and we just used plain yellow <laughs> over the top of it. Devin says, "Do it, do it!" Chanting from the crowd. <laughs> oh! And this was this was. Um, <laughs> That's right, Susan. You this was the peachy do. pink stuff. And this was the gold. Can you move that all like this? Yep. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I'm moving those away. Okay, away. We're getting ready to do this. Hello, Susan Fantasy. Okay. Okay, I needed my... We have to decide what we want, what stencil we want to use. Do we want this? Or do we want to main? And they're great just to like serve more of our. So this is this yes. is more of a mask. You can yes. have more areas that you are. I'm not finished yet. <laughs> yes. Because we've got this one to consider. Also, Tom mm -hmm. That might be kind of interesting. I like the the way. We, I guess think that the the arches go best with. I don't know though, I do love the, I love the lattice, the, the oriental lattice. Yeah, every, okay, they're saying yes, the third one. Mm -hmm. This one. Mm -hmm. I think so too. The reason is, is because I think that, to, I, I'm really feeling like a rusty brown. Yeah. Take advantage of the little um, occlusions that we've already got in there. All right, rusty brown. Oh, I lied. That's all right. This wasn't going to be like anything to write home about anyway. And we'll have some more interesting stuff happening here. There you go. Did get a lot of the red up. Remember, this was mm -hmm. done with the um, kind of... Yeah, I think it's probably kind of good that you pulled that now, because less red on that is probably a good thing. Yeah. All right, so we've got this. We know that we want this. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. We want this down, and we do not want to have anything underneath it. We want the white to be 
this. Yeah, the stencil area this is going to be yeah. it. And it's going to go over a little bit, which is kind of, it, sometimes it's kind of interesting. It leaves you a little peek at what, yeah. you know, edge of, of something. All right, what are we going to do? Um, there has been, uh, when uh, red oxide, um, yes, that's the suggestion. When I, what, no, nickel azo gold. No, the more ready one. More towards the end there. Keep moving. Towards the back. There she is. There she is. Transparent red iron oxide. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> Wonderful. Diane's stuff is officially in Canada. <laughs> they have cleared customs. She's been watching them. <laughs> Tracking them. Tracking them. Ooh, we need to. You all are falling down on. Look at that. Well, I don't know that they saw a lot of it. Oh. You've been using the big plates, and so a lot of things get squished over. And I like how, um, with the, these fluids, <coughs> they kind of, um, It'll be heavier in, in certain spots, like where she, you know, put the paint in first, which I think is pretty cool. A lot of that other stuff probably isn't going to come up, would be my guess. I'm thinking not. Now, I could have pulled Ooh. one, but when I'm using those high flow acrylics, you, you, don't, ha you don't have a lot of time to be... Um, Picking up and putting down. Yeah. yeah. It dries very quickly. And that's a good thing. Oh, I like what's sitting back there. Woo hoo hoo. Very cool. I like that. I do too. I like it a lot. A oh, lot. A Oriental lot. Lattice. Pardon? Oriental Lattice is the name of the sentence. Yes. Okay, I'm putting this back down. And there will still be some on there. <coughs> and I'm going to come over here to this. Pardon me. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm so scratchy. And We've had the heat on. <laughs> so we're dry. <coughs> Plus whatever little, you know. just seems like I've got something there that I can't get rid of. Oh, I can feel the splashing me. <laughs> See? My little splash is on mm -hmm. my finger. But this is going to kind of activate, reactivate that. And again, we don't have a lot of... Oh, uh, Brad made that one. Yeah, that's a Brad one. Uh, yes, it is extremely icy. Like, this, the ice just keeps falling from the sky. <laughs> it doesn't snow here. It ices. Oh, that's nice. Let's see if we can... This will probably... We'll, we'll just leave that and pick that up with something later on. But we've got some interesting stuff mm -hmm. going on there. Now, I could right now put down my famous pull up everything mixture of mm -hmm. Lucas Krill Pastos Beige mm -hmm. Amsterdam Extra Heavy Gel Medium Matte plus Root Harder. Oh, that's a good call, yes. Uh, Fran says, I like this one. It's sort of cross between Mysterious East and Sci-Fi. Yeah, kind of puzzle-like and then, you know, could be a little alien. <coughs> True that. We've got some kind of mucky muck here, so we'll just go ahead and clear it, clean out the. I pot. know, Lynn. We need to change our 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 filter. That is true. Um, it's been a month, and we we want to clean them monthly because we figured out that that is definitely a yes kind, a factor. It, yes, and then getting them cleaned. I tell you, getting somebody to actually come out here and clean these things has been quite the adventure as well. 
but it's probably due as well. And sometimes I think that the reason this is lumpy is because I didn't mix it up especially well. You know where I have pieces like that right there. But, you know, and when, oh, well, that was good. Did you see that skate across there? We had a conversation about that, Susan, but, um, you know, for rugs, furniture, anything from the Orient is Oriental. Um, it is appropriate to actually use that term. Asian actually speaks of the people and the region versus the, you know, because it is like the Orient. So that was kind of, we, we looked it up and fell to that. Oh, that's a good call. I'll have to check that out. Thank you, Lynn. We figured stencils could fall under that. Ooh, very nice. That's it. It it got a lot of good goo on it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well this one. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at in 15 minutes we pulled that. And this. I, I, I'm very fond of that and I think that was such a good call on the... Bye, um, Ellen. Thanks for hanging. Red iron. Mm-hmm. Oxide. Okay. Hey, and we're kind of right on time there. A little over, actually, but that's good. Got her done. Very exciting stuff. All right, guys, we will be back on Thursday because it will be Thursday Thoughts. Yes. He has lots of thoughts. I do. I have a pile of thoughts. Say pile. Yes. Um, <laughs> I like that karma. That's sweet. That's funny. Yeah, and I kind of think it just depends on the people and, yeah, who you talk to. So, yeah. Um, we will be back here on Thursday. If you want to hang out with us and many of these lovely folks that you see here in the chat, that's over in the Makers of Mixed Media Art and Artist Facebook group. Please answer the questions, otherwise we will not let you in. But that's the place to hang and find out like ATC swaps and tag swaps and it's the beginning of the month. So it'll be time to sign up for many of those awesome things. Very exciting, very exciting stuff. Alright guys, well we'll see you back here on Thursday. Bye. Bye. I just can't believe I haven't...